with Speedy going all the way. Okay, I fucks with Speedy. Speedy said you're going to get this 120 and you bought the promo on me. I want to be in the highlight reel. That's what I'm talking about, Speedy. Grab your fucking nuts and put them on the fucking table, all right? Put your dick on the table. Let that motherfucker go. You know what I'm saying, Speedy? You ain't no hoe. You ain't no hoe. I got a lot of respect for Speedy right now. I got a lot of respect for Speedy. Oh, he said, nigga, you ain't got this shit on like that. You ain't real like that. Nigga. You ain't got it like that. Speedy. Speedy now. Speedy now. You, <laughs> boy, you over here looking like you trying to win. <laughs> I thought, I thought, you know what I'm saying? Speedy, I thought. Speedy. Speedy, you look like you trying to win, nigga. What you doing? Nigga, I thought you was trying to win for a second. Boy, oh, hell no. Nah. Speedy, what? What's going on, Speedy? I thought we was cool. I thought we was cool, Speedy. You trying to goddamn win. I had a fucking goal. I said 120, nigga. I need to get to 120. Oh, no. No, no, Speedy. No, let's back up. You, you, you wildin' with that large shit. Dude. That man swung in the middle of the Oh, Speedy's ready for it. Speedy! Speedy! Stop pressing buttons, Speedy! God damn! Round three. Okay, you said, oh, appreciate that. Uh. One. Nina? Appreciate that. Welcome to the realm of the real. Only the real could you. Glad to have you in here. Who the? You was in here about to watch 120 happen. Your boy made it to Fusion. Without me. Oh my god. I ain't made it there yet. Not if my boy Speedy got something to say about it. Oh, Speedy, come on with the long ass combo. Speedy, what's going on, Speedy? Here we go. Give me the fucking nuts and the neck. I want it all. The nuts and the neck. Play Speedy one more good time. Oh, Speedy dipped on. That's right, y'all. That's right, y'all. Say Ona. Okay. Ona. All right, Ona. Appreciate it. Amen. 120. 120. And we got the goddamn promo at the same time. You know, so we out here running wild. We done made it to the blue rank. Ain't lost a game since we started playing. Now, people think I be making shit up. This is what be killing me, dog. Folks, really, let me look y'all in the eyeballs right quick while we celebrate. All right. Everywhere I go, unbelievable shit happens. All right. I'm just trying to let y'all know this. Everywhere I go, unbelievable shit happens. And then when I tell people that this shit happens, nobody believes me. And there's almost never no proof or there's very little proof. And then when there is proof, they don't be wanting to see the proof. So y'all got to witness it. Right? You know what I'm saying? How long I've been playing for this streak? Um... I don't know. I mean, ever since I started rank match, I hadn't lost no matches. So that was probably like a couple of days on the stream. See, this is what happened. This PlayStation used to be in the other room, like in my bedroom. Then I had my other PS5 in here, but I had my other PS4 account in here. The one that's the Tekken guy at Prime. That's what I normally stream from. Wait, hold on, no, no. That's not right. This PlayStation was in here, but it had the other account on it. 
and then I had this account on my other PlayStation in the room. So I was playing on that motherfucker, and you know, I was just like, oh, nobody don't play me on this motherfucker. Like when I go to my Tech and God Prime account and I try to go join rooms, niggas just kick me out immediately. So it'd be like, man, how the hell I'm supposed to be? Do- how I'm supposed to play? I can't play, right? So then I was like, all right, well, let me go on this other account. I went on the other account, and I was like, all right, man, I'm just gonna jump in rank and just play, cause no, you know, I'm in beginner mode. Nobody wanna play a beginner in the damn um, in the rooms. So I was like, all right, I can't play in beginner. So let me rank up a little bit, and as I rank up then like when I get about you know green ranks or some shit maybe they'll start letting me play bro I jumped into beginner mode beating the brakes off folks just running through them as, as, as expected right just supposed to be out here tearing folks all the way out the frame right but then I started noticing I was like it ain't nothing for me to get a 50 piece like I done had 50 pieces in player match Many a times. I just had a 50 piece in player match. What, like yesterday, I had a damn. Was we, was we streaming yesterday? One of them streams, I forgot which one. Maybe the last time I streamed, right? Last time I streamed, I had a damn 45 piece in the damn player lobby. Like, it's nothing for me to get 50 pieces or for me to have a 50 piece or a 60 piece. I was telling folks, I have had what we call t shirts, right? I'm really one of the only people who gives out these things in Atlanta, but you could end up coming to my house and getting a t-shirt right here, live and in person. Now you'll say, Mike, what the hell is a t-shirt? What you gonna give me with them Tekken House shirts? I mean, you can get a Tekken House shirt, but no, 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 no. A t-shirt is a hundred piece, okay? I've hundred piece several people before. Some of them knew what they was doing. Most of them knew exactly how to play the game, but they wasn't like, at the level that they need to be at. They kind of like these people I'm playing. There's like, you could lose to them. You could lose to them. And most people probably would lose to them at least one time. But my problem is I start winning and then I set goals for myself. Like other people, they'd be like, man, I beat a nigga like 25 times, man. I got bored, right? It's like, no, I'm never getting bored. I'm just gonna set a new goal. I beat you 30 times, can I beat you 40 times? And then when it hits 50, I'm like, oh, if I get this motherfucker to 60, I'm going for the 100 piece. And then when I hit 60, morale is at its lowest. But you know, I'm not gonna let you be down in the dumps, all right? I'm not gonna let you be down in the dumps. You know why I'm not gonna let you be down in the dumps? I'll be like, listen, man, you almost got it. You almost had me there, all right? Let me help you out along the way. You know, I'm not going to, you know, make you feel sorry as hell. I'm going to goddamn teach you along the way, encourage you. So you stay on the sticks long enough to get that hundred piece. All right. When that hundred piece happens, I'm screenshotting it. Okay. Don't worry about a thing. I got to put it in the archives. All right. Don't worry about nothing. It's cool. No, I'm not going to put your name out there. I don't, nobody's ever going to know who it happened to. All right. Don't worry about that. This is for personal records. All right. 100 pieces all right i got a 100 piece let me tell you about this one dude he i i, I got a 146 piece on somebody one time i beat him so bad shout out to him he a wrestler now but uh he introduces me to other tekken players as the guy who 100 pieced me ice man if you in here tell him i ain't lying Tell him I'm not lying to you. I tell him I'm not lying. I promise you, this is how this man introduces me to everybody that I don't know. I went on his stream and he was telling everybody in the stream how, oh yeah, this is the man who hunted peace me. I was like, bro, you gonna tell you just gonna tell people that? You just gonna be out and just tell everybody that shit. But you know what? I didn't rub it all in his face and shit, you know what I'm saying? I just tore his ass up he might have went outside and uh you know might have teared up a little bit because he just he wanted to play armor king he was like man i just want to be good at this shit and i was like well bro you know what you're gonna be there this was in tekken 6 was it or tekken dr oh it must have been tekken dr it probably was tekken dr 
a hundred piece my homeboy drill host even though you want to know what that nigga drill host did this is why i don't fuck with that nigga like that but i love him but i don't fuck with this nigga dog that nigga drill host came over the house let me tell you how i met my best friend right i know this is way off the topic this nigga drill host i met somebody at my job and his homeboy was a dude that did music with him he plays video games his name is ro shout out to my boy ro y'all might have seen him playing me in street fighter one time or two right so i was like oh man i'm super gross in this street fighter i mean this tech and shit like i'm probably one of the best in america in this shit it's like no nah, man i got a homeboy that'll dust you right and then guess what he said come on over so I met his homeboy. I'm over at his homeboy house. Now, I don't know these people. I pull up to the homeboy house. They got these big-ass plasma screen TVs. Now, if y'all don't know much about the plasma screen back in the day, them shits was laggy as hell. All right? Laggy as a mug. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. That's how it went down for him. But this boy, this man, uh, drill hose, right? He's the friend of the friend that I came and whooped up on, right? Now, he got this laggy TV. So I'm beating his ass, you know, per usual. But it's laggy. So then my homeboy drill hose come over, right? But I didn't know drill hose at the time. This is the first time I ever seen this nigga drill hose. So he come and he playing with Oscar. Man, I'm playing them and shit. And this motherfucker running up and doing the damn snake edge with Oscar. And I'm so used to being able to just see this shit and block it that I'm amazed that I'm getting tore up by this shit. Like these niggas hit me with the snake edge over. It's like I'm playing online with one bar connection. It was the worst shit ever. I was like, oh, I know this nigga don't keep hitting me. That nigga managed to beat me like two times. I was like, oh, hell hell no we going back and forth i was salty as hell i was like man hell no this laggy ass tv that nigga never let he never let me he was not gonna let me live that down so you know what i told him i said hey man we got a gaming house you know what i'm saying we call it tekken house you should come on over one day you know what i'm saying you get to play your kids i was like you know and he was like yeah yeah I, I think i heard that name before yeah uh up at north the cab mall and stuff yeah yeah i'll be playing with all them folks you know what i'm saying it's like, okay, yeah, man, yeah, I'll come on over there. Motherfucker should have stayed his ass on that laggy TV. This motherfucker came over to the crib. Now, I don't know if y'all know my boy, Big Boy. Big Boy is one of my training partners when I first started playing Tekken, you know, as a professional player. And uh, his brother used to stay with us. Or his brother used to come over there. His little brother used to come over there. So we start playing, and the next thing you know, I'm playing this nigga drill hose. Triple perfect. Perfect. Beating the brakes off of him. 20 piece. 30 piece. Triple perfect. Goddamn, then here you come. You hear your boy uh, Terrell come out of nowhere. You getting peed on? Oh, you getting peed on? Psst. Every time he get perfect, psst, psst. you just hearing this shit over and over again, just tearing his ass out the fucking frame. All right, 80, 90 wins, 98 wins. What y'all think happened? What y'all think happened? If somebody could guess what happened. Oh, that boy, Mac Panther, already been told the truth. He already told them the lie. He didn't told us. He didn't told y'all. I was about to give y'all a goddamn. I was about to give y'all a goddamn uh, shirt for the shit. But Mac Panther didn't already didn't told y'all now. This man hit the start and select on me at night eight. Hear me out. Guess what his reason was?
talking about some, hey, let me go to the practice room right quick. I want to practice something. I said, what? The practice room? He said, yeah, man, let me go to the practice room right quick. This nigga went to the practice room. And did like a hot kick or some shit. He was like, is that your unsafe? It's like, nigga, you know the shit unsafe. What you talking about? Oh, I just didn't know it was minus 12. I thought it was minus 10. All right, we can play. Beat his ass 10 more times. But I'm just saying, bro. Man, fuck that nigga drill hose. I <laughs>